Welcome back to Rain Two. Today we're going to be playing today's guidance, and in today's video we're going to build a park. But before we do that, we need to. We have a worker, nine of educated workers. So to solve that, I tried increasing the education budget, but that didn't exactly work for our capacity, and also this doesn't really affect all of the area. So I'm going to place one high school down in this little square here. Then that will just get refilled with houses eventually at some point, or probably during this episode at some point. So now I can get rid of these abandoned buildings, and then I also want to split everything up into districts. So in this way, I can supply stuff that needs to be supplied to areas, because in here they want um, lower taxes. So I can add a tax relief into this like neighbor area. So I'm gonna say this general area is not gonna be one big district. So let's just build around this. And we aren't gonna include those businesses, but they'll be in it for right now. But we're gonna have everything along here, and then we can just fill in everything in the middle. And then this area is gonna be probably the biggest residential area. This is going to be basically all of the original part of our town. And also, I'm still looking for names for this city. Or, well, right now it's a town. Then we're going to have our shopping district. That basically is all in here. And all the way up to the main road. So, basically right along here. Then... Just need to be careful that we don't intrude on the industry. We can actually add on to that. Because we're going to have... Shri will get its own zone too. And then it will have its own little area. So these businesses will be included in here. Basically everything that's on the right side of the road. This main road here. Then we can also get rid of over here. And then, right along here, we can also get rid of it. Then we can get right along here, taken care of. Okay. Okay, and then we have our industry along here. This is going to be our generic industry. So this would be our last and final zone. So basically, I'm just going to put the outline for my crosses along here, turning from industry from the shopping district to the industrial district, I believe. Yep, those are shops. On here. That's, yeah, that's correct, I think. Yeah, that's right. We just want to do that. We don't want to have the industry district into there. And where did the industry district go? We want to have it here. Then right along here. So then, there we go. There we go. So that would be there. And then I'm not going to give a industry for the forestry area because it kind of already has its own industry. It has its own district industry DLCs. And Elm Park, because they're complaining of taxes here, we'll give them. Oh, we can't. Uh, that's at eight thousand citizens. I was gonna say we can give them some tax relief, but that doesn't seem that we're gonna be able to do that. While we're at it, we can also lower the education budget back down to we'll say seventy-five percent. I think that should be good for what we have, because now we don't just have one high school; we have two. Then I will add one in the new area once we expand out to right a bit more because basically it reaches most of, well it do basically just doesn't reach there, at least it did when we had the much a little bit higher. So now we should have basically this whole entire area covered. Ooh, we barely have any of it. Does the budget affect that? I think it does. So you know what, we'll just bring it back up to 100%. That should hopefully... Increase it. So now we have 2-7 capacity. Yeah, that'll increase the area. 
So this area is kind of just starting to wear off here. Then, kind of just in between where we get kind of affected. But it's kind of just going to need to deal with that. Oh, and then power problems. So that's always fun. But it's not exactly the funnest thing to do. But there you go, that should solve it for the time being. And then trash will end up being collected. Hopefully, that should solve our power problems. And then, let me see the trash processing status. Alright, so just the back here just becomes bad production. So I basically just say we add our recycling plant to it, and that should, yeah, it's gonna be close that we're gonna get about fruiting on the areas. So then we can also get rid of any abandoned buildings. Okay, I'm sorry about the taxes for these guys. But so in today's video, like I said a little bit earlier, but you might have forgotten, we're going to be building a park using the Park Lake DLC. We might build it over here, which actually, let me just double check. No, there's a little right here. So we may build it over here. We may build it over here. I'll find a place that we can build it. Probably we're going to build it somewhere in here. Because we got to compensate for not having a school here. So... I'm going to show time lapse of me building this, but do we want to do an amusement park, a uh, uh, city park, a zoo, or a nature reserve? Probably not a nature reserve. I want to say we can do a zoo, yeah. I think that that would be good. So, well, I'll build in time lapse, and so, build a time lapse. Stop 
this gravity It keeps bringing me down
Okay, so I'll work on getting these parking lots in in between episodes, or at least during some episodes, but I'll work on it in between the episodes. Hopefully I'll be able to get it like this one is. But so, right now it's level 2. I'm uh, right, we're pretty far from um, level 3. Big fact, we need about 1,500 more visitors in the park. Very well, in the zoo. Which I did add a bus line that goes from here, right here, and then right over here, and then over here. Basically, I just put the two stops right around where basically our little hubs are. So, like, here we have the hub for most of the buses that are in the side of the river. And then also some of the buses that go over here, since we can transfer from this side over there from just taking buses. Then I have a smaller, um, uh, hub over here for the buses, and I have a stop for it back here. So basically it just goes from here, to here, to here, and then back over to there. Then we still have tax problems, that's probably... Did I accidentally? Yeah, I accidentally raised it, that's why. So that can fix that. I'm sorry, dear citizens, for accidentally raising your taxes. But so, I, mean, I put this in as kind of like a cool thing just to have this, um, here. But I think I'm gonna actually just get rid of it. Then we'll reconnect this up. So that's why everything is there. And I have the double decker buses for the 60 capacity, which that may seem a little bit overkill for this line, but without it, these these stops would be filled. There's one of 90 when I first did it, basically immediately as I started it. So yeah, it's very popular. It just that it's far from where a ton of the population is. So this bus stop allowed people to go from say down here all the way into basically right at the front door of this. And a lot of cars are parking here, but that's just what I'm having there. And so, I believe this will be it for this episode, and I do hope that you've enjoyed. If you have, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!